Hey, hey, Spring Lafay, Simple Tara, Aki Aquarius. This is for you. I'm, I'm drawn to this deck, so I'm going to use it. For Aquarius. For my fellow Aquarians, what do they need to know? Spirit, what is the message for my fellow Aquarians? Choices. You have plenty of choices. So, your message is to really look at those choices and be clear about what you choose, it feels like. Follow your intuition when making these choices. Loyalty. Where does your loyalty lie? Differences. Differences with people. Um, self-worth. Okay, know your self-worth. You're going to have a big choice to make. Um, and this, you know, 3-3, three, three, you, I feel like that for some of you, you could be getting a wish come true. Um, and I'm getting yin and yang on this differences card. Um, you could, this could be for some of you that are on the twin flame path. You know, it's like you're coming, someone's coming in to union with themselves. It's like, oh my goodness. It's like they're loyal to themselves. They're loyal to their own uh, well-being. They're loyal to um, their own differences. Do you see what I'm saying? It's like, um, oh my goodness, they've done the shadow work. They've done the work. Um, they're making their own choices. You know, they know that they're dark and they're light. They're balancing. Do you see what I'm saying? It's beautiful. It's really beautiful. There you go. <laughs> Thank you, spirit. Beauty. I love it when they do that. Let's get one more. Oh my God. See? Loving yourself. Loving yourself is how you're going to bring forth whatever it is that you want. It's beautiful. This is beautiful. Oh my goodness. It's all within you. It's accepting yourself for accepting you. For you. You know, everyone has their own things and it's like you... You have learned to accept yours. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So, this truly is beautiful. And they wanted to reiterate that with giving me the beauty card. <gasps> um, love it. Let's see. I feel like it should take you an angel card. I think I'm going to take one of these. They actually give us two. And uh, for those of you that, you know, you're looking for romance, I'm going to take your romance angel too. Okay, can I have it? I may have to cut for it. Nope, I don't. There you go. That says it all right there. But I'm drawn to the bottom. We'll take the bottom one too. Um, but that says it all right there. Love yourself. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. And yes, it does. Okay, this one. Ah, you deserve love. You are lovable. And yes, you are. Love yourself. Oh my God, that's beautiful. And then we have here, oh my goodness, the number six, open your heart and ace of thought. This could very well, you know, you could, on this romance, the romantic, you know, the romance angel cards, if you're looking for romance, you could be dealing with a soulmate or a twin flame. Um, now, this ace of thought here, it says, This cherub has arrived to congratulate you for your brilliant new idea, which is truly inspired. It's important to communicate clearly and thoroughly with others who are involved in the implementation of your idea. Don't be dissuaded by little challenges along the way. These are merely course correctors, corrections to perfect your plan, to perfect your plan. So, course corrections to perfect your plan. That's awesome. Open your heart. Allow love to grow and bloom all around you. You've waited for this emotionally fulfilling experience for such a long time and now 
the time has come. Make your choices by listening to your heart. We got the choice card up here. Make your choices by listening to your heart. And then following the steps you're guided to take. Joy will lead you to a vibrant and healthy life. That's beautiful. And for those of you wanting romance, that's two people. It's not alone. That's beautiful. So that's what I've got for you. Uh, thank you so much for being here with me. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. And um, thumbs up. And please do subscribe. And have an awesome, awesome day. Much light and love. Bye.